Hello guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Jesper Offersen and today we are going to look at a uh, moisturizer. We are going to look at a moisturizer which is for uh, dehydrated and uh, dry skin. And it is uh, this one here from uh, Simple in their water boost uh, range. So uh, first I would like to say that we are today for the first time filming in uh, 4K. So hopefully uh, this will give you an even uh, closer look at uh, how my skin look, uh, how uh, the things that I talk about that I do for my skin, how they actually uh, work and how uh, it uh, looks in reality. Because it is so that when um, you upload in HD, as we did before, uh, then when you are uploading uh, to uh, YouTube, it will make it a little bit uh, blurred. And also when you are uploading at uh, 4K, I expect it to be a little bit uh, blurred. But uh, 4K is uh, as good as we can make it in order to uh, compensate for that sort of uh, blurriness. So uh, 4K, that is uh, in order for you to see uh, my skin even uh, more uh, close up and if we are doing makeup or whatever we are doing then you can get an even uh, better look at it so uh, today uh, we are talking about a moisturizer so uh, therefore i have uh, not put any uh, makeup on or anything like that so again that you can see my skin uh, completely clear so uh, now we are filming in 4K and actually it is about nine days since I filmed last time or since I uploaded the film last time and uh, I have been a little bit busy because I have been uh, doing up my flat. So uh, you could uh, maybe expect that when I'm filming in 4K that I have done a lot in order to prepare my skin to look its absolute best. But uh, I must disappoint you and say I have not. This is just uh, how my skin looks. And for the last week or a little bit more, I have basically uh, a lot of the days I have not even cleaned my skin morning or evening. I've just been like, okay, I can't really be bothered. Uh, and some days I even uh, wore uh, sunscreen uh, for several days without uh, taking it off. And that is a big no-no and so on. Did anything happen? No, it didn't. And what was the result? This is re the uh, result that you uh, see. So uh, what did I do today? Well, I cleaned my face as in I shaved and uh, I uh, did a light scrub with uh, mineral oil and uh, tartaric acid as I have shown in another video I will link to up here. And uh, after that, I used my uh, serums that I have made myself and uh, which I can link up to here as well. And uh, after that, uh, I simply just uh, did what I normally do. And that is uh, to uh, use, um, first of all, I use the uh, hydrating booster from Simple, a little dot of that. And I mix it into uh, this cream here, which is uh, the moisturizer that I use from uh, Ambriolis, the uh, Le Creme Fluide. So uh, have I tried uh, this one? Yes, I have tried this one here. And uh, I will say uh, it is a light cream as such. Uh, there is no oil in it. There is a lot of uh, glycerin in it. Uh, and then it is a, a water-based uh, cream. Um, so uh, why did I try this one here? Well, I saw it uh, in the uh, shop and I thought, well, uh, this is not something I thought I would use, but I thought there might be someone out there that would like to use this one. and. Uh, Therefore, I would like to give it a review. So uh, I bought this one here and it has uh, no perfume. And as they always say, simple, they don't have any sort of a harsh uh, chemicals in it. There will, of course, be people saying that, oh, well, there are some harsh chemicals in it. That is kind of like uh, people have uh, different opinions. But as such, simple say there are uh, no um, harsh uh, chemicals in it that will upset your skin. And it didn't upset my skin at all. Uh, it is um, a sort of... Um, opaque-ish um, cream so it's very uh, light and it does come on uh, on your skin as it being a very uh, light and if you just uh, put it on like this I have of course already a uh, cream on today um, but um, it is very easy to smear out and it uh, kind of like it uh, it's not greasy in any way and it sinks in uh, very uh, well as such uh, there might be uh, some people that think it kind of like gives a um, a sort of a, a second skin on your skin or something like that is that sort of a feel and that uh, I would say that is because uh, it contains a lot of uh, dimeticone so it actually contains various uh, types of uh, dimeticones um, and uh, kind of like very high up uh, on the list also um, 
Do I think that it gave a, a lot of moisture to my skin? Well, it might be that it is designed to give a moisture to your skin, uh, but the problem I would say is that um, it doesn't lock in moisture that well. So uh, what I did uh, was that uh, after a couple of days of uh, using this one here, I uh, went back and uh, used uh, what I normally do, and that is uh, this one here, and then uh, a little dot of this one here. Because uh, what I like about uh, the uh, Water Boost series from Simple is uh, the ingredient uh, saccharide isomerate and that is something that uh, locks in moisture to your skin but I feel that you need uh, something that is oil based in order to lock in uh, that uh, moisture and uh, that uh, you don't have uh, with this uh, cream here so after using it uh, for a couple of days I felt that uh, I would like to have something that uh, gave my skin uh, uh, more moisture in the sense that more moisture was kept in my skin uh, during the day and I know that people are saying that uh, dimeticones they are there uh, both to give a nice feel particularly in the hand creams it gives this sort of um, silky sort of a feel uh, but it's also there uh, to lock in uh, moisture um, I would say I don't really like uh, Dimeticone for that. Uh, I prefer uh, a product that contains mineral oils, uh, just like uh, this one here from uh, Ampoulis. So uh, my verdict uh, on uh, this one here is that uh, it is not something I am going to use. I have tried it and it felt nice on the skin as such, but I think in the long term, if you want to give uh, some moisture to your skin, you need uh, something else. And uh, that could be a little bit uh, of this one here, which I have spoken about uh, before in another video, uh, and then uh, lock it in with uh, something uh, that has a uh, mineral oil in it. That is what I do. That is why I have uh, the skin that looks like it does today. And and uh, also because I use uh, lactic acid as in one of my serums, which uh, I say uh, you can see in one of my uh, other videos as I link to up here. So uh, yes, um, this is not something I would as such recommend uh, in the long term. It didn't upset my skin, it didn't bother me as such, there was no perfume in it, or it was kind of like a nice product, but I just feel that in the long term it doesn't really give uh, enough uh, moisture for uh, the skin so uh, yes that was uh, my verdict uh, on uh, this uh, product here so uh, if you would like to see more of this sort of videos please subscribe hit the bell and do all those things you must do not to be notified when i upload more of this sort of uh, videos thank you for watching see you bye